Hello friends, uh, welcome to my YouTube channel. Uh, dear friends, I am Nyanuba Suryavanshi, the author of This is Spoken English. Uh, friends, today I am going to tell you uh, the story of my English journey or I am going to tell you how I started speaking English. Uh, dear friends, uh, when I was in 12th standard at that time, uh, there was the craze of deer. DEAD means Diploma in Education. So many uh, students who were in 12th standard, they were preparing very hard for DEAD. They wanted to crack uh, 12th standard exam and get enrolled for DEAD. And I also wanted to do DEAD and I also had studied very hard when I was in 12th standard. But unfortunately, I got 74% uh, marks in 12th standard and uh, the DEAD list was closed uh, for 75% and uh, I had 1% less. Uh, that's why I could not enroll for DEAD. And when I could not enroll for DEAD, after that I was frustrated and I was thinking, now what should I do? Why, why there was the craze of DEAD? Because uh, the students who were getting enrolled for DEAD and this was two years course. And after completing DEAD, uh, they used to get a government job in JHP school as a teacher. And that was very shortcut uh, to achieve government job. So, so many brilliant students and so many clever students, their goal was to go to DEAD and become a teacher. And uh, other students also were there. And uh, the students who were taking uh, taking science faculty, their goal was to become a doctor. There were only two goals at my time when I was in 12th standard, either to become a teacher or to become a doctor. And as I had come from a village, yeah, I was not very good in English. So uh, when we are not good in English at that time, students were taking arts faculty and the students who are good in English, they were taking science for 11th. And yeah, I was not good in English, so I opted arts faculty and I completed my 12th standard education. But uh, unfortunately, I could not enroll to DEAD and then uh, I meet my teacher and I met my teacher and I wanted to take advice of my teacher. Then my teacher said, Mr. Ambore sir, he was English teacher. Okay, he said, if you are not able to enroll for DEAD, then don't get nervous or don't get disappointed. You can do career in English. Now you are studying English and your interest is in English, then you should enroll for BA English. You should take uh, uh, BA and optional English. Then I decided to take optional English. Uh, yeah. And now I enrolled in Sri Guru Buddhiswami uh, College in Purna. And uh, yeah, I took uh, subjects English, uh, political science, philosophy, and I completed my BA or I completed my graduation. And when I was uh, gra at graduation, I was doing very hard. I was giving most of the time to improve my English. And I was studying, uh, studying English, I was studying poetry, I was studying novels, I was studying drama, I was studying comedy and tragedy. And we had good teacher. Uh, there were three teachers, Mr. Bhange sir, uh, Mr. Rajkumar sir and Mr. Fudd sir. All the teachers were very good. All of them were fluent in English and yeah, they were inspiring us, they were motivating us uh, for studying English. And at that time, there was fear of English in the mind of students. Students were afraid of English. Nobody was taking optional English because students were thinking that English is very difficult language. And so uh, it is not uh, for them to study English or they are not able to study English. But um, I had taken decision and I had accepted challenge and I had said to myself, I will accept this challenge and one day I will become fluent English speaker and I will become a good English teacher. And so I was studying very good. I, I completed my graduation and I got good marks. Uh, in graduation, I got first class and there was one paper criticism. This paper was for BA third year and this paper was very difficult. All the students, uh, maximum students got 35 marks out of 100 marks in crit criticism. But I was the uh, I was one only one student who got 65 marks in criticism and then 
after completing my graduation i went to nanded and uh, i took admission in people's college for ma and uh, when uh, we went to nanded and we we were doing ma at that time our, there was our teacher and he was motivating us to go forward and to say few words in english there were so many students more than 100 students were there but uh, students were not uh, going on uh, going uh, ahead or going in front and saying words in english but uh, i i thought that this is a opportunity and we have to uh, we have to uh, take benefit of every opportunity and uh, yes there were 10 to 15 students from our purna city who were going to nanded uh, for taking education for doing ma in english and i went on the stage and i said a few lines about myself and when i said a few lines about myself at that time that teacher appreciated me and he motivated and encouraged me and from that day onwards i started speaking in english yes i was speaking in english with my friends i was speaking in english with my teachers but yes i was not fluent in english because i was thinking in marathi and then translating it in english so it was taking time to me uh, after uh, ma first year then i took admission for beard and uh, uh, when i was doing beard in beard uh, we have to go forward and many times uh, uh, we have we have to give lecture or we have to deliver a speech because so many activities are conducted there cultural activities are conducted there uh, birth anniversaries and death anniversaries are conducted in beard college and at that time we have to deliver a speech but i was interested in english language so i was preparing in english uh, whenever there was some uh, program i was preparing in english i was going forward and i was expressing my opinion in english and uh, day by day it was helping me to improve my english it was helping me to improve my confidence and uh, i was becoming good in english then after completing beard i completed <coughs> uh, my second part uh, of ma english and after completing my second part of english uh, i went to one college and i <coughs> did their job uh, for taking experience i taught there uh, to 11th and 12th standard student and uh, when i was going on class uh, uh, initially i had to prepare in english without preparation i was not able to teach students so uh, when i had a lecture tomorrow today i was uh, taking out that textbook i was studying it very well i was studying it thoroughly and i was i was preparing very well i was i was thinking in my mind what i have to say there or what uh, i have to give the explanation for that i was preparing it in my mind and preparing in mind or self talk uh, it was helping me a lot uh, to improve my english and uh, after that uh, i uh, after that i came to sompet and i gave interview in one school uh, for uh, say, uh, higher school uh, say, sorry Uh, for uh, secondary school uh, i i went there uh, i go interview and uh, i had to take a demo they gave me 10th class uh, english textbook i went on the class and uh, i uh, took a, uh, took a lecture and for all the lecture i was explaining things in english and then they selected me and uh, from that day onwards Uh, i have been working on my english yes uh, we can say that nobody is perfect in this world or uh, we are the we are student uh, throughout uh, throughout our life means we have to uh, we have to achieve knowledge our whole life and so nowadays also i am working on my english yeah uh, i am on the way of fluency uh, we cannot say i am perfect or i know everything because uh, even uh, we will go to foreign and uh, native speaker native speakers also make mistakes while speaking but uh, but we don't have to pay attention towards our mistakes every day uh, yeah we have to improve our english we have to work on your english if uh, we are working if we are reading something uh, we are listening something we are watching something in english definitely 
uh, a little bit uh, progress is uh, taking place uh, of our english and we have to work on our english every day and now i have accepted a challenge that every day i will make one video on some topic and i will upload it on my youtube channel and it will help me to improve my english and there are so many english lovers there are so many students and there are so many job holders also they love english they want to learn to speak in english but uh, they are uh, they are struggling to learn to speak in english so i am here to help uh, my friends uh, to improve their english and my dear friends if you will uh, follow my channel and if you will watch my videos listen my videos then definitely it will help you to improve your english uh, dear friends um, but i want your support because i have less subscribers if you will subscribe my channel then it will motivate me it will inspire me and i will be able to make video every day so dear friends if you have not subscribed my channel then please subscribe it share it to your friends and recommend them to subscribe it if you like this video uh, then uh, you can say it in comment box or if you want to express your opinion about my video then you can express it in comment box if you want to suggest something then you can suggest me in my comment box uh, dear friends uh, thanks a lot